welcome to the weekend loving on myself vlog <laughs> okay um not much is going to be going on i'm not going to lie to you you guys know i'm sounding a bit nasally sorry about that my sinuses are going crazy they're going real really crazy um however ugh, i hate it when i see clothes hanging from my like does anybody else hate that i hate it and i'm the one who put them there so it's not like anyway um so yeah i just got ready if you see my hair my hair's got a bit of white in it today was a hair wash day okay i need to go cut my hair but anyway um so i just got ready don't really have crazy plans today i'm gonna wing it one thing that i do want to do today is just drive out to the nursery because i bought two new sort of wicker basket kind of pot plants like um pot planters um so i want to get two new plants for that yes i'm a bit plant crazy but i can't tell you uh i really can't tell you guys how much plants make me happy so uh, yeah and i recently bought two new plants which you might have seen in the video um the clips beforehand i was watering them and spraying them we're going to talk about those when i go downstairs i am actually quite famished it is midday and i just finished everything i read for a couple of hours in bed and mm, i've had a rather interesting weekend <laughs> rather interesting but we're going to sit down we're going to chat this is the book that i'm currently reading you guys know it's got tabs on it and all of that because it is a brown skin reads book club book um hence why i always because talking points and all of that aside from that gonna go downstairs gonna make breakfast gonna make myself a really nice different kind of breakfast something i've never done before but something that will be very easy to prepare as well um yeah let's go i'm feeling very period painy i feel like auntie dot wants to show up i'm feeling very period painy abdomen pains hmm. all right let's go eat let's so go these are the babies um this is a monstera um it's cute it's small um i was spraying them up in the morning just giving them some water feeding them giving them some life but you know um but it's normal place it's pretty much over there right on the counter over there where the cup is that's pretty much where it sits and then this is i forget the name i haven't named my babies yet they're fairly new it's, it's it's been about a week okay so they're fairly new and i haven't named them and i feel like this is one of the longest processes for me it takes me forever to name my plants <laughs> forever so um i'm taking my time with it but if you've got any name suggestions definitely let me know down below um i forget the type of plant this one is i threw out the tag when i picked it up i picked these up from pick and pay i was actually quite surprised that there was um pick and pay stocked such lovely plants like i knew with flowers but with plants i was actually quite surprised and they were like 100 rand a pop or something this was 100 rand because it's smaller this one was about 150 i think but it's great easy to maintain you water them like once maybe twice a week just spray it up and um give it some you know water but yeah that's pretty much it and then the orchid that i got uh months ago last year sometime died <laughs> so the leaves are still alive and i'm trying to actually bring it back to life i can't bring myself to throw it away so i think i overwatered it i think that was the problem i overwatered it but she yeah. reminds me in here we've got her and she's been through a lot she was the one that was most damaged uh when i put them out in the sun and i forgot about them completely like overnight so she was the one that was most damaged so a lot of her leaves fell off as you can see that's so um i watered her yesterday i watered her yesterday but i just wanted to come on and actually just spray down her leaves give her a bit of water and her branches i feel like the the whole idea is the branches just to get a little bit wet this is an old window lean container but it's just got water now um that's what i keep to just spray down my plants give them a bit of water but she's coming back quite nicely 
I'm really, really happy to see it come back into full. Yeah. So, yeah, she's coming back quite nicely. I'm really happy to see it come back to full, like, green. It was really quite sad. Seeing, seeing her the way she was really broke my heart. And there's a couple of new leaves. I can see this one is new. Um, and this one next to it is also relatively new. So something is happening. Something is coming right. This is a rubber plant, in case you wanted to know. This is a rubber plant. I got this one from Woolworths. Woolworths has them all the time. So even if you wanted to pop in there, they're about 600 Rand. Uh, but they are quite big. Mine just looks a little bit sparse right now because she got damaged. But she's coming. She's coming all right. I'm literally going to make what they call to toad in a hole, which is basically an egg in a hole of bread, like in the pan. Um, really, really easy to prepare. I don't need to run you through it. You're just going to see what I'm gonna do. It's really, really simple to prepare an egg. I think we know, we all know how to prepare an egg and how to make toast. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna add maybe a little bit of spring onion to mine and uh, seasoning and maybe a bit of cheese maybe a bit of cheese also maybe a little bit of like viennas like literally half of vienna just for the meaty uh, side of it all i feel like i want to do it i want to try it i've never done it before i'm feeling very oof abdomen painy-ish like period painy it's really really weird okay let me make breakfast and let's get on with the business of the day yay well that's that's a good looking breakfast if you ask me so there's the egg with the spring onion with the salt and pepper and then this this is the bit of the bread that's nicely toasted up now that looks gorgeous i need to do an instagram picture okay and uh and then yeah avocado and that's pretty much breakfast that's what i'm gonna have for breakfast that looks delectable yes from this angle you can see it it's gorgeous let me make some coffee 
and then get my grub on. Okay, so I've just made my cup of coffee. It's good, just took some pictures for the gram, so I really haven't touched the food yet. Um, hopefully it's not cold. But let's see what happens. Ooh, the egg is not like wet, 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 you know? It's, 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 the, it's, it's really cooked quite nicely. So we love that. My God, my mouth is like literally watering, watering. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, I was worried that the bread wouldn't toast through, but it has. So my memory card died and I had to change my memory card, but what I was saying is, the bread is actually quite toasted through, which is actually quite nice. It's nice, it's crunchy. Mm. Mm. You've got the salty and the sweetness of the... Um, you got the salty of the egg and the saviness of the egg. And take a bite of that. And then you take a bite of the strawberry, which is sweeter. <laughs> mm, it's beautiful. Mmm. Okay. I'm going to be making this breakfast a lot more often. This is nice. But definitely for um, a weekend, not obviously when I'm going to work. Let me finish this up. Um, and I'll get back to you guys a little bit later. Hey y'all, um, so I didn't really want to go out today, <laughs> after I ate I fell into this little like food coma kind of thing and I felt like I didn't want to go out and then I gave myself about an hour and I thought okay well it is Sunday, it's actually Valentine's Day today, I didn't mention that because I, am I celebrating it this year? No, um, I could be. But I'm not. <laughs> anyway, so I'm on my way to the nursery now. Just just a nice drive, you know. I felt like, you know, get out the house for a little bit. Um, I felt just get out the house for a little bit. Why not? Um, so I'm just going to pop out to the nursery. I'm not even, I'm like literally wearing my flip-flops that I wear in the house. So I'm not really prepared to go anywhere else. I love people out and about. This is so beautiful because when you're in the house, when you're in the house, you kind of don't see the stuff until you drive out and then you see that, you know what, people are actually out and about having fun, doing picnics. I'm coming to the nursery, which a lot of the time is often empty. So, there's like a car wash. Hi, hi, thank you. It's like a car wash. I'm coming to the nursery. Half the time the nursery is empty. It's beautiful. Like I really like uh, our nursery a lot, a lot, a lot. So let me pop in there real quick and I'll talk to you guys in a bit. That, that was an epic fail. They literally, I'm sure you must have seen the clip now. They literally don't have any stock. And this nursery um, in, in my area is the best one. Apparently the lady was saying that people are buying like crazy. People are buying like crazy. So unfortunately, there's nothing this time around, which is kind of a bummer, but not much I can do about that. This area is really, really nice. Um, it's it's like they have a car wash here. They've got a nursery. They've got a big, huge kind of park kind of set up as well. Um, so on Sundays, it gets really dark. You know? Obviously, it was fairly quiet because of COVID, 
but I feel like everybody's out and about now and there's this car wash that they have here it is packed full to the brim which is so nice and there's sort of like an eating area as well really really nice uh, what a pity I'm really looking for I need to find myself a very good like nursery a big one around where I stay because I can't be let me uh, let me go try Oops. got things that are shaking here let me go try Builders Warehouse Builders is also kind of crappy the Builders there by us is also kind of shitty but it's well worth the try Today was a damn fail. I went into builders, found nothing, and because it's so hot, I decided to get myself a uh, a mocha freeze. So Seattle Coffee Company has this freeze that I used to get a lot of the time, especially when I was still into sweet things. It's got this um, uh, butterscotch butterscotch freeze I couldn't do the butterscotch freeze I just can't do it anymore now I wanted something still quite cold and enjoyable but not as sweet and this one this one does that are we in reverse yes we are let me just uh, pull out of the parking lot quickly thank you sir so I'm also gonna make my way home oh this is good if you're not somebody who likes really sweet things but you it's very cold hot chocolatey kind of vibes very very nice mm, mm, mm. oh yeah I needed a, I needed a sweet pick-me-up so what I did is um, builders was a fail so I took a little walk around the complex because uh, I really like the checkers here. The checkers here has a really nice home section. Like kitchen stuff and... Um, what's this? Kitchen stuff, lounge stuff, bedroom stuff. It's got really, really nice things. Um, I like it more so for the decorative features. And I did pick up some things. Um, because my coffee table... I just wanted to change... On whoa, 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 whoa. Don't fall, guys. Don't fall. So on top of my um, on top of my coffee table is that little sort of tray. Um, that tray has been relatively the same for quite a long time. So I wanted to change it up a little bit. Um, so I went into checkers to get just a few things that I know would just boost that little uh, tray up. I've been using that tray for a um, long time with the very same. Um, you know like the, the the very similar same decorative features so i went into checkers today to try and see if i can find um if i can find something different but also something quite summery but something quite cute looking and i did find a couple of things so i'll show you all of that when i get home but yeah the plants were complete fail okay hey i'm in the house uh, before I show you what I picked up from Checkers, it's really not that much, but I want to show you now because I really kind of, I kind of want to rest. <laughs> Resting is, is really important to me nowadays. So the other day, I got a little package from Kaya Letu Candles. It's a company that's launching uh, candles, and they're launching their new range and these are sort of vegan and soy candles i'm trying to find something to open this up don't use knives at home kids 
okay? Please don't. Oh, that's so pretty. Look at that. It's so pretty. I don't want to ruin this. Okay, let me get my phone. Hang on, hang on. Hey, I'm done. So I had to do a little bit of an Instagram thing. You know how it is, content creation. So these candles are from Kaya to Candles and God. So look at that. Oh my God. So they had a little note for me, which is here. I have already opened it. These candles are... Uh, soy and vegan candles and this is called the nude collection and it comprises of three very beautiful women hello different body types different tones different shades look at them they are so pretty they're plus minus 95 millimeters and there's currently three main scents so one is chardonnay one is pear and cinnamon and one is pomegranate and fruits i can't really quite tell Oh my gosh, I'm trying to smell them and they smell different. They smell amazing. So they make, they're made with a 10% soy wax blend, blend and um, wait, they are made from soy wax blend uh, with 10% bean paraffin wax uh, so that it helps maintain the shape of the sculpture. That is so pretty. The packaging, I die for beautiful cat packaging, guys. Like, I really do. Thank you so much to Kaya to Candles. Uh, we love to support small businesses. This is amazing. This is so pretty. I feel like I need a picture for the gram, okay? And I feel like one of these should sit somewhere there by my coffee table. These are gorgeous. So, so pretty. So from Checkers, this is what I got for my table. That table, the coffee table right there by the TV stand. I want to change up the current setup. Let me show you what it looks like right now. So this is the little container that's on the, the little tray that's on that table now. It's got these Christmas things that I need to move now, finally. And it had some from the Christmas. If you watch my Christmas vlogs, you would know this. And this is pretty much what it looks like now. Very basic. And I wanted to give it a pop of color. So I popped into checkers. I still really love the tray because look at the tray underneath. Pretty, hey? I still really love the tray because it does go with my decor in that room. But I wanted to change things up a notch, you know? And I picked these up from checkers. Look at how cute these are. Very bright, very pretty. Um, I, I feel like it was compensating for the fact that I couldn't find plants and I really wanted to find something really cute and colorful. Look at these. So pretty. And I think it's like 85 rand a pack and it's fake so you don't have to worry. And then I also got this tray. And then lastly, I also got some pillar candles which are going to go on top there. So let me try and set this up and see what, I, what magic I can make here. <sighs> let me think about it. So I also wanted to show you the other day I got a little tea sample by a company called The Tea Room. So uh, The Tea Room is a company that's also launching, a proudly South African company that's also launching in soon. And <laughs> I'm not quite sure when they're launching, but what they're doing is they are making available you know, all the, the, the goodies and treats that you have at a high tea and all of that, they actually bring it to you. Um, what they do is they give you a unique high tea experience from the comfort of your home 
or hosted by us at a venue. So I've been eating the things little by little, but for the life of me, you guys know me and sweet things are, it's not a vibe. But I just took a bite out of this, which I thought is something like a nougat or something, but it's not. But what I do realize that it's got pistachio nuts on the inside and it's so good. It's so good. But right here, this is a strawberry, honey. Okay? Mm-hmm. I'm going to take a bite into it now. Let's do it. That's the strawberry coated with white chocolate. Um, I'm assuming that this is the strawberries dipped in chocolate. Oh, man. I can handle this because most of the contents inside is a fruit. It's a strawberry. So it's not as sweet when you bite into it. Um, I'm sorry. It's not like the chocolate sweet, you know? It's so, so good. Oy. I had another pink one the other day on social media. <laughs> on Instagram. This is good. And then you've got the chili chocolate and black cherry macaron. That's what they look like. I'm not a crazy fan of macarons, but I do enjoy them. I can eat them, so it's not... It's not um, I don't know which one to try. Chili chocolate. Black cherry. This is black cherry, I'm assuming. Mm. Actually, I don't know. Mm. <clears throat> this is the chili chocolate. But it's really good. It's got... You know how chili goes really, really well with chocolate? It goes well. It's like orange goes really well with dark chocolate. This is good. Yeah, yeah. Wow. Okay. So, thank you to the tea room as well for sending me this. I really appreciate it. Check them out at the tea room sa.co.za. Also on Instagram uh, as mm -hmm -hmm. the tea room online. That's on Instagram. So, definitely, if you're going to have a high tea, tea party kind of, ooh, that is definitely chili chocolate, honey. I'm telling you right at the back there, but it's actually so good. The sweet and the chili. Nice mix, nice vibe. But if you're definitely thinking of having a high tea, but because of COVID and all of that, you don't want to, you know, you want to maybe have it from the privacy of your own home and all of that, definitely try them, check them out. You'll see their Instagram page and all of that. I was going to cook today, but I don't think I will. So that's that on that. That's that on that. Um, okay. <clears throat> so I'm going to rest a little bit. Chill out. Um, I'll talk to you guys in a bit. I don't. I really don't have much to say. So I'll talk to you guys in a little bit.